Hello and welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, I'm so happy you're here. My name is Brittany and I cook all things gluten-free. So let's get in the kitchen and start cooking. Today in the kitchen, we're unboxing the espresso machine that we got on Amazon. It's the Chefman espresso machine and we're gonna take it out of the box. The Porta filter comes with the single shot and the double shot. And the coffee measuring scoop has the tamper on the bottom. In the back of the water reservoir, I'm gonna go fill that up with water and plug it in. We've got it plugged in and I'm gonna turn it on with the power button. The buttons have a single shot button and a double shot button where you can choose uh, which size. And then it has the manual coffee button and the manual coffee button allows you to customize the volume of your espresso by adjusting the amount of water dispensed. It also has a steam button so that you can activate the steam and froth the milk. To place the porter filter, and you would put it underneath the brew head with its handle facing to the left with one hand on top of the unit to steady it. Insert the porter filter into the brew head, lining up the handle with the open lock on the unit. Slowly turn the handle to the right and you will feel some resistance as you align the handle with the locked icon on the unit and the handle will be at 90 degree angle. Let's make an espresso. I'm gonna use the double shot and so I'm gonna use two scoops of finely ground coffee. And then after I put in the coffee, I'm gonna press it down with the tamper side of the spoon I'm gonna put the porter filter back in as we practiced earlier before. It will position to the left and then we will turn it towards the right. This espresso machine did not come with the espresso cup and I had to buy that separately and I can link that down below. We're making a double shot, so I'm gonna push the two for the double shot. Okay, this is about done, so I'm gonna go grab a glass. I'm gonna fill it with ice, about three-fourths full of ice. Pour in the espresso. And I'm gonna use a splash of 2% milk. I'm using the Tirani Sugar-Free Classic Caramel, and I'm gonna use one tablespoon. And you can use any um, syrup to make a change and difference. And then you can also use frothed milk, which we did not use that function today, um, but that, however, is available on this espresso machine. Enjoy, dinner is served. Thank y'all for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe. And let us know what your favorite coffee drinks to make are with your espresso machine. We'll see you next time in the kitchen.